Sinner Man is... Oh, wow, this is the garbage dump place. We can walk there? It's actually... Kind of close, all things considered. Kind of. If we keep walking this way, it's gonna go back into the city. And wow, does that mean that this entire area is a garbage dump? Holy crap. We don't even have a location name. Um... We can do some of these ones along the way, too. These little blue ones. Sure. Although, is there gonna be a place where I can't even look up what this is about? Because all I know is that we're murdering somebody. I'm really hoping that once we get to that guy, the client, he's gonna give us a bigger overview on what exactly is going on. Apparently someone going to trial and... not being convicted. Being convicted? Not being convicted? As guilty. The night skies of Night City, everybody. It was nice to be in the nature for a while, even though there wasn't really that many trees and stuff. It was mostly sand and deserts, but it was still nice. I love this double jump. If they had more time, I get the feeling maybe these empty houses would be a bit more filled out. But maybe not for the moment. Maybe later on. Who knows? I know The Witcher 3, when it first came out, it was kind of like that too. But when I played it, it was quite a few years after it came out already. So in terms of bugs, those were fine, but... Mm. Rancho Coronado. We're back in this district. Who's here? Scavengers. Okay, so no need to... Who cares? Let's go all out. Practice our... Practice our mantis blades. Are we gonna die? Probably. Oh! How dare you apart! There's my cold blood. Oh, there's like a whole... Hold on, there's a whole camera place over there. A warehouse? Oh yeah, what is this, a rave? Can you find a better way to go about this? Calm down, calm down. Should probably do some proper pinging and all that. Who's shooting me? Somebody there. I need to ping you first. Now I got all of you. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That's a lot of people! We're playing with fire here, the way we're playing right now. Yeah, that's a rave light. That's not a security light. Oh no! We can do this. Beautiful. Is that it? I wonder if street cred is affected by how we do things. If we go in especially violently, would it mean that we would get more street cred because the whole thing was like a big ruckus and therefore more people would logically know about me because I raised a storm? E9. 55 BD, awesome. Huh. Very small rave. Maybe they were just setting up. They didn't even finish. The speakers aren't set up. Hold on. Were they doing drugs here again? I don't care if you do drugs, okay? Just don't bring the little kids into this. I know they use the kids to transport the drugs. Sent to 13 users. 
techno surprise. All right, comrades, time to mow some gongs down. Rich kids looking for a good time, a little danger, trying to party on the edge? Let's fucking give it to them. Grab your gear. Time for a harvest. Ah, uh, we know what harvest means in the context of scavengers. Those freeloaders are walking, talking money bags. We just slice and dice, and the good stuff lands in our hands. Parties in the warehouse down by Lawner, Lawler Tunnel. I don't know if we managed to save any of them. Get ready to rage in the warehouse down by the Lawler Tunnel. Hey, dwarfheads. Got another night ahead full of the best boosters, beats and bangs. Hype? Let's be real, we know you are. The lineup. Five hour warm up with Sade. Then a wild ride at 200 BPM with Mr. Skin. Finish things off with everyone's favorite Lisa X. Join us on a trip to the dark future. All these kids. Oh, these are the kids. They're dead already. Yeah, this person looks like they're here to party. No. Oh. Well, at least we murdered them brutally. Especially the first guy. That was a new animation that we saw with the Mantis Blades. Good. I would say we should call the police to clean this place up or something, but it's not like the police aren't horrible people in Night City either. So who do you call? There is nobody to call. We can do another one. Another one nearby? What do we have here? A garage? Yeah, give me that athletic experience. How much do I have to run for you to give me more? Oh! Damn, I wanted to I wanted to get over the this wall. I guess we're still at the edge of the city. It's still very quiet here. Combat cab. 6th Street, Night City. And I can't get over. We're just kinda stuck on the side. Whatever the intention of this wall is, it's working very well, because I can't... just can't get over. Any other yellow ones nearby? Danger high? We could try a high. It's not super high. Try just to see if it's doable. Very high would probably be a little bit too hard. But hi... Lady, you're alone. Dude, where are we? We're in like the back alleys of the place. Who are you guys? Scavengers? Killing you anyway. Without provocation. You're in deep shit! What was that about me being in deep shit? Oh, would you look at that? They got dismembered. How sad. How sad. Awesome. Didn't give me anything, but they were scavengers. And as we all know, there are no good scavengers. Probably. Random people? Rancho Coronado was the place where everything is clumped up. The industries, uh, the, the factories, the houses, entertainment, if there even is any. Sounds like a dream, but isn't. Yeah, that one's a little bit far away now. That's okay. We'll get it sometime. And I really could just be driving a car, but why? Why drive a car when you can run endlessly in the middle of the night through Night City? I sound like an ad. Wow. Scale of things. Santo Domingo. Alright, mister. I'm gonna have to... No, I can't! I can't. The car owner is too strong. Or maybe the car is too strong. Yeah, we're almost there. Almost there. Gas station again. Scavengers again. We good? 
I'm doing this in the middle of the city, though. We are getting closer to where people are, and I see some civilians being pretty scared of me. <laughs> Man, I haven't done stealth in a while. Feels like the combat is pretty nice. Very nice just, uh, rush in and do stuff. Alright, what's going on here? Do I have to interfere? Valentinos? I might want to help them. Not that they would really even know who I am, I guess. But they're my enemies. I don't think they're my friends. Maybe we'll watch a little bit. Watch. Yeah, okay, they got... Whoever they were trying to get. Six Street Gang versus Valentinos. But I gotta get the Valentinos. Is that okay? No conflict with Jackie's people? Beautiful. That was beautiful. Beautiful. Who is this? Alfred and Darius. Send you guys here. But who's gonna be here with me? Police? Chum just sent them. We got a shitload of merch here. I gotta got it all by myself. Not the police. Is it my fault Gunner ordered the manhunt? I got orders to grab your people, that's that. Thumbs the brakes. And I gotta track down Flavio. You got a problem with it? Take it to General Gunner yourself. Fine, fine. They're on their way. No worries. Everyone eventually meets Judgment Day. Whoa, is it just me or is my street cred suddenly going up pretty fast? We just got 33 like five minutes ago. That was fast. Because I've been going on a killing spree, that's why. <laughs> What's this one? We don't know what it is. So we don't know if we have to rescue somebody or not. We just gotta figure it out once we get there. Maybe let's not be so threatening. Oh, I couldn't jump because of you. EOV, check it. There's a site on the net out to smear the mayor, Weldon Holt. Well, the acting mayor, because, you know, he's up for re-election or whatever. Yeah, politics, am I right? Mudslinging never stops. Not for a minute. Anyhow, my client wants that site sucked into the cold vacuum of cyberspace. Scan the brief if you need more info. I just gotta destroy it? Agent Saboteur. Bring down the propaganda machine slandering Weldon Holt. Politics. Only thing slimier than the thongs that licks. At least corpos usually tell you to your face how they're gonna screw you in the end. Fake smiles, impossible promises, shameless pandering. All foreplay until they fuck you in the ass and pay themselves for it with eddies out of your wallet. It's in their nature. And what's in ours? Blowing shit up. Six Street's got a stiffy Jefferson Perales. Yeah, Jefferson Perales. His name is Jefferson. Antonio is the brother that died, right? We saw his grave at the, um, the place. So they have these servers pumping out anti-hold propaganda. They see Perales becoming mayor as like the second coming of Abraham Lincoln or some shit. Here to unite the city with the NUSA. Naive gonks. Anyway, just destroy the machine, basically. Is it like a computer machine or? No, it's barbed. Everything is barbed. <laughs> Here we go. What is this building? It's so... Oh, it might be one of the mega buildings. 07. Find the garage with the servers. We don't need to kill everybody. This kind of mission would be nice if we can get in without being seen. Let's get in here. Anybody else? Freak ton of people.
people in every corner. Sixth Street. We don't have that much, uh, I don't know too much about them yet. Hey, how come I can't... I can't mark them. What's going on? Is that no, no go? Another camera? Oh, this seems like the server. Looks pretty promising, although we can't see inside. That... Let's... Uh, we don't have to do this one stealth. No one ever said to. Why don't we just freaking friendly mode and... Get in there. We'll see what happens, just by standing here. Will they associate it with me, though? Whatever's happening here? Oh, is it dead already? Oh! Great job, little turret. Oh, but they killed it already. That was fast. Now we gotta figure out where the spot is, because I feel like probably the server. There's a very high chance it's that place. Probably over there. Wow. I cannot believe. I cannot believe. Did he see me? I missed that simple jump. You're kidding me. <laughs> E9, 1C, 7A. E9. 1C. BD, 1C. Yeah, I don't know why I can't mark him. That's probably not the server room. But we can have a look. Let's get back up. Oh, but there's people up here too. Um... That person has a very high chance of seeing me. We can reboot optics and try to get close to him and then kill him. Can you see me from here? But I can't even jump over. That's too far of a gap. Oh, it's gotta be there. Yeah, you know, the fact that they have a sniper here looking right down at the room, that's how you know it's the room. But I gotta get you to go away too. And this guy's looking, this guy's looking, everybody's looking. You're dead. If I... Target not a threat. Oh, I was hoping I can like... Make the camera mark the enemies as enemies, but that's not gonna do anything because there's no turret here. Okay. You know what? Screw this. Don't have all fucking day. Let's go. Exactly right. We don't have all freaking day. Are we all happy? You guys want some? Oh my god, this is going too well. <laughs> well, they never said eliminate the gang, they just said upload, you know, figure out the servers. But this is okay, right? This is okay. We all happy? It's gotta be this. Jordan, M, and Dustin. That Kang shard figured it out. What's on it? Schematics. Iron? Smart iron prototypes already checked. Not on the market. And time to buzz Militech, see how many eddies we're sitting on. Install malware. Oh, my own shadow scared me. Someone's gotta be around here, right? Actually, the combat's done. Okay. Mark to Zack. Hello. Order shipped. 
Miss Bravo 773 server systems. It's a big package. Loyal supporter and concerned citizen. Dear Team Perales, I'm a huge Jeffernut. Jeffernut, okay. And he's amazing. I want to vote for him. But what about the recent black blight that has been infesting our city schools? This is an important issue to me. I really hope you can tell Mr. Perales about it. Does he intend to stop the recent flood of illicit black market brain dances into our schools? Black blight. Our children are being exposed to all sorts of disgusting and evil material at an age that's formative and critical to their personal growth and to decent citizens. Now I did my homework and I know that BDs are addicting to adolescents and sometimes it just takes one brain dance to get them hooked. We need to act now. We need a mayor who can do something about this. Unread, so far. Well, if the... Hmm... If the Jefferson guy is working with the Sixth Street Gang, a gang. A gang, okay? Like, uh, I don't know what the Sixth Street Gang does yet. But is it anything super malicious? No, I want to install the malware. We nail one asshole to the wall and another rises up in the polls. Politics is fucking usual. <sighs> Sorry, Johnny, but I don't have time for your little anarchist revolution. Yeah? Well, it'd be easier than slicing heads off a fucking Hydra. One more reason this city could use another nuke. It's too far gone. Just start anew. Give up on this one. Snakeskin cowboy hat. Oh, sorry. Nobody here has heads anymore, basically. No, you guys still have heads. What's this? Anatomy of a Disaster, NCPD. This won't be the kind of book that's full of eloquent phrases or elaborate metaphors. I'm not a writer, I'm a cop. Or rather, I was a cop, before the mass redundancies. I'm not writing this for money or fame. I'm writing it because I'm pissed off and won't stay silent while the NCPD goes to ruin. Before you say anything, I know, we aren't perfect. Night City has never been a safe city, but we tried. As God is my witness, we really try to keep our city safe, even while we lack the money, people and equipment we so desperately needed. The mayor couldn't have cared less. He wanted to cut costs. Apparently, since the NCPD wasn't profitable, he said at a press con a day after seven of us were killed by a cyber psycho in Vista del Rey, then why not privatize it? That same day, NCPD was transferred into private ownership. Oh, wow, okay. Our new chief of police, previously the head of the data term sales department, cared only about one thing, money. He fired half the force, cut down a number of patrols, and ordered the beat cops to drop everything and start writing tickets. Didn't take long to see the effects. City's crime rate went through the roof, bodies clogged the alleyways, and the sidewalks were painted red with blood. Meanwhile, the suits at Corpo Plaza were popping champagne and celebrating. Why? Because the demand for private security services had increased by a thousand percent. Privatization of police. How's that working out for ya, Night City? We read Perales' campaign promises before. I remember he grew up in the slums too, so his whole thing was about how, oh yeah, I totally understand how you guys feel, but did he have anything specific to combat that concern? And what about like stuff like the black market BDs in schools? His opponent is Holt. The mayor that died is Lucius Ryan. <laughs> how far away is Elizabeth Morales anyway? Might be a good idea to look into that, especially since we're talking about Perales right now anyway. So high. It wasn't really high because we didn't directly combat with anybody. High is fine. It seems fine. I suspect for the Asian saboteur ones, if you're good at stealth, maybe they wouldn't be too bad anyway. Can do that one, but what's nearby? What's nearby? Blue! Uh, yellow, yellow, yellow. Epistrophe! And we got a few going on here. 
Yeah, maybe let's uh wander down here instead. Do a bunch here, and then we'll go to either Claire or Elizabeth Morales, something. Which way am I going? Delamain. Okay, Delamain. Oh, there's two here. So many car quests. I want to get rid of all of them. You did it, V. Just got word that virus is blazing toward the servers like a fucking asteroid. Prim work. And thanks. Closing the gig. I haven't even met you. Hey, what's wrong with pierogies? Why are you guys blocking the store? Look, Street Cred 35 already. It's going by blazing fast. If all they do is snort lines and blast the stereo all night. Can't get a wink of sleep. And if you complain, they'll find out and come after your ass. Wish things went back to the way they used to be. You mean when Mega Bloks didn't just let any piece of human trash move in? Exactly. Quality control of the tenants? Me mega blocks? Is that the mega building? Yeah. That the apartment or uh Yeah, that the people live in? Why can't I check my phone? A replacement vehicle, what? Oh my car's coming. No, that's Wait, that's uh that's freaking Scorpion's thing. Oh. Apollo. Okay. Oh my god, I'm, I'm sorry, Scorpion's car. Do not enter. Are we even going the right way? I kind of wonder. No, this is going like a different way. Hold on. Hold on. Probably better for me to just jump off here. Oops. <laughs> We're fine. What's with all these walls here? Feels like this area has quite a few... Arroyo? We're now in Arroyo? Train tracks? Whatever's happening over there? Cranes? Construction? Why am I running again? I don't have to run! I can... I can take a car or something! But it's nice just to look around. Look at that. I'm sending the coordinates of a vehicle that went dark near to where you are now. Thanks. I'll try to find and reset. Oh, it's moving. It's a moving one. Oh, shoot. Sorry, V. Better catch up. my car let's go let's go we can do this one too I guess it's closer what is it I hear gunshots already did they just say the sector is on lockdown Oh, there's two here. Oh, whoa. Hey, you okay, man? Woman? Mark Elberg and Robert... Smurgowski. Dear Robert, we are pleased to inform you that the council has approved your lease of the home on Malagra Street. Okay, he's leasing a home. Did we get a follow-up quest with that? Or what is that about? That's it? He's leasing a home, but he's dead. Is it one of the ones where... We get a different quest? Malago Street. Report a crime. Stroke of luck. The dead don't talk, but their money sure does. Check out the house. Mr. Skunky Scuba over here. Sure won't be needing those eddies anymore. 
Ah, uh, it's the stash. It's right here. They've got these palm tree looking things. Oh, hey, can I? What? Another problem? Oh, I just wanted to look at what you were cooking. That's all. A good way to get perk points is to level up skills that we normally don't use because level 1 skills are easy to level up. Which means if you want more points, you gotta keep trying the new skills and try new things. We got trouble. Whoa! Whoa! Got a little bit carried away here. So we're at the house. We have a cul-de-sac here. These houses look very... Like North America? Yeah. Come on, don't drag this out. I won't. Don't you worry. Box all the way up here. Three thousand euro dollars. Robert. Robert and deleted. Yo, my grand just kicked the bucket. Gong didn't find the change in her will. You bring the stuff today? You got it already? The inheritance? Sure do. She leave you a lot? Shit ton, Chum. So how about it? You coming over? Sure. In that case, how about I bring some extra? We celebrate together? Sounds like a plan, Chum. How do these people delete their tracks like that? Oh my god, this guy... But he left the money here. So his friend killed him even though he didn't get the money? How does that work? Oh wow, there's so many... There's so many garbage dump places here. Another one. Got a thing. David to James. James Ben Ben. Oh, justice behind bars. What's this one about? First things first. You'll get you a cut that'll make all your doubts about this disappear. And now, this is what you're gonna do for us. You go to work, pick up some stuff on the way, some good shims will come to you with gifts, so no worries. You toss the goods around the yard, on the kitchen, whatever you want, say what you want, just make sure the kite flies right. You keep your head on straight, you'll be chilling in a penthouse and ordering the best joy toys. We clear? Clear. Toss them to the kitchen, they'll spread them around. Just know, you snitch, you swing. Boys will start coming by tomorrow, later. They're always talking in code, just in case if someone's reading. Is this making drugs? In the kitchen? It's always drugs. <laughs> hmm. Okay. So I did see the pop-up this time. Reported crime. Did we do it? Yeah, justice behind bars. The prison guard was in Sixth Street's pocket. That doesn't seem related to what we read here. Is it? Where is it? It's kind of close by. Yeah, the reported crime ones, they always point you to some kind of other thing. What about epistrophe? Uh, epistrophe first. It's kind of on the way. But we need a car. We need a car for that. Oh, buddy! Buddy! Hold on, hold on! You see them too, don't you? The curve in their beaks. It hides something, something insidious. I mean... Flamingos? Shit, she's too far. Flamingos? I'm coming, I'm coming. I mean... Flamingos? Whoa, whoa, whoa! So they are real. Flamingo. Flaming. Oh, the O. That's oxygen. There's no flame without oxygen. Listen, you- Call me Clarice. 
Okay, Clarice. The flamingos are a problem, I'm sure, but it's time to go home. Delamain's asking for you. Back down now as they stand screaming. No, impossible. Leave it to me. I'll silence them. So, a slaughter. Very well, Judgment Day has come. Swift, severe, deeper. Destroy the flamingos. What the hell are they talking about? What? This... This one's, uh, this one's got a female voice. Let's check out what this... Destroy the flamingos? Alright. Oh, there's some back here. Oh, whoa, people are here already. Flamingo garden gnomes? Garden decoration? Really? Sorry, guys. Do you mind if I just destroy these flamingos? And there's a few more in the back there somewhere. Guys, I'm not here to fight. I just want the flamingos. Dude, what the hell's going on here? They've got a freaking pool, a swimming pool, but it's filled with garbage. Uh, okay, hold on. We'll do this part first. Good. Gotta go back and talk to... Oh, where are you? Where are you, buddy? I don't know where you are. I'm out of here. Well, Clarice, have the flamingos stopped screaming? Perhaps I ought to return after all. I need support. Only one with chaos within can give birth to a dancing star. Clarice? <sighs> Shut down. Huh. Hmm. This one... This one doesn't feel like they were all there. I've just re-established contact with the missing vehicle. Splendid work, V. First class. I shall forward a share of your fee. Look at our street cred going up and up and up. We're moving up. Is Sixth Street like really all about America or something? I see American flags everywhere here. Wow, we got a gigantic ad in the residential neighborhood. Wonderful. What I was gonna say earlier is I think we should try to change up our cyber deck hacks. It's been a while. We have a lot of new ones that we haven't tried yet. Call over one squad member to kill them. Which ones do I not really use? I haven't really used Reboot Optics yet because I haven't done stealth since I put it in. Cyberware Malfunction? Oh! Disable Cyberware Abilities. I didn't know that. But between Synapse Burnout and Short Circuit, I feel like one of them is okay. We don't need both. Which one's better? This is per second. What the heck? Synapse Burnout sucks. It costs more RAM, less damage, lower duration, longer upload time. What? There's no reason why I should have this. Take it out. And instead, thermal damage. Um, I never really looked at the resistances of the people, not that closely. People usually seem to be pretty flammable though, so overheating could work. Whistle. This is good for stealth. Contagion. Cripple movement. Spreads to the nearest enemies within 8 meters. This sounds interesting. Try it out. Sonic shock. Yeah, we've got a lot going on here. What do we got? Attribute point? Perk point? See, my assault level is already 7, which feels like maybe now I should switch to using handguns so we can level it up, so we can get some more perk points. And blades. But my assault rifle is so nice though. Where would the sniper rifle go under? Is it Annihilation? No, that's shotguns and light machine guns. This is nice too. Nice. 
Uh, for now, let's focus on using, um... Yeah, maybe we'll keep the precision rifle, but we'll switch out the sniper rifle into a... Sh a gun. A, a gun. A handgun. Pistol? I can go back to trying this smart pistol again. It won't be as nice. After using it, the tech weapons feel really, really nice. I like it. And we'll leave it at that for now. So I didn't do my points at all. <laughs> Breach protocol, quick hacking. So this is stuck too, because my cool is 7. Stealth being 7. Let's level up stealth. Why? We haven't done it in a while. <laughs> I have no direction. I'm just doing whatever I want. Street Brawler. Well, we've been using blades quite a bit. We could put in a little bit. Armor increased by 30% while moving. This is good. Making sure that I can actually make use of it. Okay. Cool, cool. There is a question mark right on the map. What is that? life in NC. Getting any sleep? Cause I'm not. Not when there's money to be made. So listen, one of my people, named Juliet, was supposed to deliver me some precious data. Never made it. Getting total radio silence. Check on her, will you? And uh, don't forget the data. Specs attached. Is this very high? Oh, I don't think this will work out, but if we just check out the place... Okay, I'll, I'll save. I'll save. We'll see. It's right here. How can I not try it? I gotta at least try. <laughs> We're not going in through the front door, of course. This looks fishy. Bandages. Painkillers. Gauze. Three months ago. Almost completely used up. Not something you'd keep in your medicine cabinet. Better look around. Impressive pharmacy. Didn't even know this stuff was still on the black market. All these pills are downers. They're what you get if you can afford better. Hell of a lot for one person here. The person is rich? Black market sedatives. Hmm. Maybe I'll have the blades. America. Is that the new America flag? What a mess. Reeks too. Usual hallmarks of a merc's room stop there. It reeks, but you're sitting on their bed. Oh shit! Someone took a nasty hit on this. Signs of a struggle? To put it mildly. This is a secret compartment. It's been cleaned out. Messages. Hey. From Rose to Juliet. Julie! Oh my god, it's been ages! How's life? Sister? Guess I'm writing with something on my mind. Remember when we were kids, we played on that old dam? We'd shout our names, some other stupid stuff, then listen for the echoes? How our voices carry through the valley? Sometimes I still feel like I can hear them. Different, strange words. Like returning from a long trip. Out of town. Funny, right? I don't know, Julie. Truth is, everything's going off the rails. I feel worse and worse. Losing my job certainly didn't help. And what the hell good was that new cyberware for, huh? Ugh. I hope I'm not scaring you, or asking too much, but was just thinking how nice it would be to hear your voice, not just some echo of it. Maybe that's what I need to get right again? Rose. Echo? Listen for the echoes. Rosie, of course I remember the dam. Even the time you tried to kick that gonk Benny Dillard and his drone off it. And yeah, I did hear about your job. 
I'm really sorry, that sucks so hard. But listen, I've been talking to C. Sai? And we agree you should stay with us for a while, at least until you feel better. Come on, just like old times. Okay, so her sister came over and she has some... Issues? Money issues? And... I don't know, maybe some other stuff. Clean cut. Don't forget to go to clean cut. A ripper doc? She has not been going for like... Half a year. Half a year before 2077. Rose's journal. Respect my privacy. And it soars into me, like to the parade. My friend, let's fly. Kiss my forehead, lift me up, touch the sky. After all, we can miss it, can we, little sister? Rosie is so thankful. My beloved baby sister, fucking whore, won't understand it. No, you only listen to Julian. Echo, 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 echo. It says you have to see the parade in Japan Town. Without us, the party burns. To the parade! My friend, let's fly. Kiss my forehead, lift me up. Touch the sky. I will show you how Rosie loves you, 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 you. There! Do you hear the echo? Echo? Echo! A long time ago, we dropped a pebble from the dam and counted the fall. Two, three echoes, then four, then waited for the avalanche. Five, six, to cover Night City and you won't have to go to school. Seven. Echo, echo, but nothing happened. Nothing but horrible silence. It doesn't matter. Have a better idea. We go to the parade. Because the dam is already cracking. The dam is already cracking. Okay. The dam is already cracking. Did you get the memo? Maybe this is not the best place to be trying a new weapon if it's very hard. So I need all the strength I can get. At the minimum though, nobody seems to be here. But this house, according to the emails, sounds like it's been vacated for a long time even before we came and there's gotta be a basement. I'm sorry. Jules, please forgive me for how I'm doing this. I'm nowhere near as tough as you, and I can't pretend to be anymore. I hate to say it, but there's no helping Rose anymore. So at least help yourself before it's too late. If you change your mind, I'll be waiting for you at Sunset Motel. Think on it again, please. Always yours. They took the sister in, and the sister has... problems that they can't solve. For the record, was this openable? Hey! The truth about cyber psychos. Oh, is this a cyber. Is Rose a cyber psycho? We read it already. There's a flamingo here, too. Test results. Rose. No medical consultation needed, but regarding the patient's worsening state of mind, psychological. Consultation is advised. What do you mean find out what happened to Julie? We don't know where Julie is yet. We know that Rose is not all there, but where's Julie specifically? What painting? <sighs> if life's taught me one thing, it's that a safe's a good spot to hide your valuables. Got a reader too. Must be an access shirt around. No. Interesting. Oh. A safe behind a painting. A little cliche. But hey, at least the Merc appreciates the arts. You could learn a thing or two. Wondering more how it ended up on the ground. Juliet must have been in a hurry. Yeah. Something twisted happened here, V. It's just the birds. Hmm. Jack in. Nope. K. 
camera in the basement. We'll leave that for last. Ooh, what could be in there? Hey. Oh, same computer. The red on red status doesn't even sync in the email inboxes in 2077? Really? I'm starting to like this less and less. Best stay on our toes. Victor. To Juliet. Miss Horgan, I'm happy you turned to me instead of those clean-cut scam artists, but I'm sorry I don't have good news for you. The symptoms you described indicate a serious disorder that will continue to progress regardless of the next steps taken. In cases like this, I'm afraid no level of help you give your sister will do much good. The only real cure is one of the two max tack ways, if you understand my meaning. It's good you reached out to me, but it's best you contact them next. The quicker they get on this, the safer it'll be for everyone around her, including you. Maybe we should let Regina know. Clara. Another sister? Julie, since yesterday, Rose has called me 40 times, but all I ever hear on the line is erratic breathing, and I never get a response when I call her back. Do you know what's going on? I'm really worried. Mom. Hey mom, everything's alright. You know Rosie. When you have 100 implants like she does, chances are at least one's got a chip loose somewhere. Don't worry about it. We've got everything all under control. Love ya, Juliet. El Capitan. Julie, is everything alright? Been a while... We last talked, and I got a few jobs I can't trust anyone else with. Plus, there's still the matter of Mr. KT's data. Right back quick. Time in on our side on this one. She didn't read it. Okay. Before we look at the camera... Jack in. No. Ah, ah. <laughs> we are in a hostile area, despite not seeing anybody so far. Um. Nothing here. Let's take a look at this. Okay, we don't have an access shard. Body? This is a hostile area. Ready? Oh no. Whoa, she's got a whole setup here, but who is that? Oh no. Um... Rose. Oh, she's got a skull. It's probably going to be very difficult for me to kill her. Juliet, why? Why would you do this to me? We can still try. I mean, uh, at this point, probably for what I can do, I should just save and leave and come back later on. Juliet, why? Why would you do this to me? Which I'll do anyway, I'll save after we look at this, but man. Is there anything we can do here? We gotta figure out how to get in. That's the first step. This is the only camera. Wait, the time is all messed up, isn't it? Oh no, it's moving, it's moving. Uh, I don't believe there is another camera. We could try to hack her. The door generator malfunction. Initiate overload. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna save here. And then we will see what to do here. Because I'm guessing we're not gonna be able to kill Rose, but I still wanna try, even though we've tried this kind of thing already before. Let's see. We can try to slowly get her with. Juliet, why? Why would you do hacks? this? To me? Oh, I should have done it when she was near it, maybe. But it doesn't change that we can't go in. That computer. We need to figure out how to get in there. From what I see, I actually- well, I can't see a way to get in. She's right below us. 
two horizons. With the access shard have been in her... Oh. I'm saving again. <laughs> it might be safer for us to uh, use the camera and just hack her, you know? Because I, uh... How long is that gonna take, though? Probably 20 years. I'll try it first. The generator probably would have been nice. Did I just do reboot optics? I hope not. Cyberware malfunction. And that was a 14 RAM hack. Oh, I should be using this chance to. Julia, why? Why would you do this? This ain't working. Look at how low that- that health isn't going down. I mean, I can waste all of my- You know what? I might have a chance if I use a tech rifle here. No, this is doable. This is doable. It's cheap, but it's doable. And we, we need all the advantages we can get here. There's a good old chemical damage from Nash's gun. This is way- What the hell? She just healed! Oh my god. This is insane, but it's working. This is probably the only way we can do it, though. Like, we literally can't do it any other way. But it's such a waste of resources. Oh my god. Whoa, whoa! Just don't heal again, okay? This is insane. We're spending so much time on this. Is that helping? Slowly. Oh, great. One misfire and I'm done. What's this? We're here already though, so I don't want to leave this quest hanging. Oh, man. So it is doable, but it's definitely very turtley. But it's doable. I want to help you, but I don't know how. Hey, you there? I saw the lights on, in your house. I know you're not sleeping. Who is this? Rose? I live facing you. You have to help me, now! They want to kill me! Hold on, what's going on? Who wants to kill you? Julie and her husband! They work for the corpse! They're trying to poison me with poison gas capsules in my bedroom! Please, you have to help me! Have you been drinking? Taking anything? You don't get it! They're the ones doing this to me! They took my hollow so I couldn't call anyone! Cool your tits, lady, okay? 
People are trying to sleep here. The police are also in on it. I'm begging you, please. Hmm. We can't... This isn't a Regina job. That's so sad because I can't actually do anything for her. Uh, maybe, maybe after we do this part, maybe we can tell Regina about it somehow. Now we can look around down here. Feel bad leaving her like that, but there's nothing we can do. In that case, I don't even know. Mm. What can we do? Mercy killing? But that's the whole point of what Regina has been trying to do. Figure out a way to, um... Save these people. High temperature, migraines, difficulty speaking. Delirious. Some improvement. Rosie isn't complaining of pain. She's eating and talking normally again. Maybe the new pills work? Attack. Oh my god! Size arms broken in two places. Gave her a triple dose. Calmed after one hour. As usual, she doesn't remember a thing. Sigh, that saint of a man. Lied and said it was a hit and run. She's back to normal, no more pain. She even made us breakfast. Christ. Even though these pills are draining our bank account dry, they're at least doing the job. Just need to maintain a higher dose. Rosie is back to herself and only once did I think I heard her talking into an empty room. As long as she's not hurting anyone. Day 91, another attack. Had to give her four times a normal dose. Why do I bother? I can't do this anymore. Oh, she really tried to help her sister, but... Oh, that's a knife. She really tried to help. But there's nothing... So far, in current technology, there's nothing we can do. Order confirmation. The medicine. Medicine lottery. Oh... That's so sad. And even now, even now, we still can't do anything for Rosie. I really want to at least give her to Regina, though. Shard. Can't have bad luck all the time. Is this really it? This makes me so sad. Mm, well, uh, it's a hazard leaving her here. She might attack somebody, or she might hurt herself. Oh, I guess that's that. Wow, that was entirely depressing. We'll go to this drop point, because we can do this one next. Man. A cyber psycho quest that's not even Regina related, because we were only here for the shard. That's the main function.